What an interesting times we are finding ourselves in. Coming into 2020, the business environment already has been such an interesting place. With a volatile economy in South Africa, volatile political situations, the COVID-19 pandemic, it's made things even worse and even more difficult for entrepreneurs to survive and make their businesses relevant. South Africa being one of the countries in the world with the highest unemployment rates, we know that entrepreneurship and entrepreneurial activity will be one of the biggest solutions to that problem. If we look at countries like Germany, people don't realize this, but up to 95% of their GDP is generated by what they call the middle stunt or in South African context, the small and medium enterprise businesses. This shows us what a significant impact entrepreneurial business can make to a country's economy. Since 2005, I've been in the situation where I had to become an entrepreneur. I wasn't necessarily born an entrepreneur or the most natural entre entrepreneur, but I had to become one in order to build a career and, be, and get some employment and income generated. Like many South Africans, that is the case today. Over the years, I've seen the difficulty that entrepreneurs go through on this journey. A big part of that is the lack of support, not ne necessarily financial support, but the lack of operational support, just an ear to listen, a soundboard when you need to develop new ideas, new products, and just know what the market thinks. It is with this that I've been talking to the church leadership and, and Pastor Ross over the last year to see how we can put something together to support the entrepreneurs and the small business owners in the church. With that being said, we launched CityGate's Small Business Support Project, um, which is a project running uh, with Shofar Durbanville. And within this project, we will be having three main legs that the project will be standing on. Firstly, there is an online directory that any entrepreneur within the church can go and list your business free of charge. And with this, our aim is to see how much exposure we can give our small business owners within the church and also the wider community. Secondly, we are starting a small business incubator program for those entrepreneurs and business owners seeking the support, seeking um, operational support, strategic support, or whatever support may be needed in order for them to build their businesses to the level that they are envisioning. And thirdly, we will be hosting our Redemptive Entrepreneurship Grow Group, where we will be coming together on a bi-weekly basis to journey together on this journey of being entrepreneurs and becoming Christ-centered businessmen and women, making and building impactful businesses. So I would like to invite every business owner within Shofar Durbanville to join us in this exciting journey, join City Gates, load your business onto the online directory, join our grow group and become part of the incubator program. We're looking forward to seeing you there.